M0FXBA learning ham sphere. So here's my radio just here and we are going to add a waterfall. So we're going to go to the ham sphere shop. There is a home page here that you can look at as well. Lots of information talks all about ham sphere easy to use amateur radio software. Okay, so let's go back to the shop and buy the waterfall. I'm just going to go plugins. And the quickest way I think is to do a search. So we just go water fall. Enter. You can actually sell these plugins apparently. So let's add it to the basket like so. Go to my cart, check out, enter my call sign. M0FXB, sign in. Looks like we have to use credit, so we're going to top up our credits here. Brings us here, and we buy some credits. Ooh, so we have Hamsphere money. So let's buy, we need 10, don't we? So we'll add that to basket. Go to my cart check out how does this work yeah so they're saying always buy the credits first then then buy the you know the item that you want so we'll go back to the cart and we'll click remove and now we'll check out our 10 euros check out click continue for paypal then we'll go to my paypal add that back to basket Check out now. We don't want to top up, we just want to pay. We will continue, click that and continue. Confirm order. Do we have to tick here? Continue. And that's it, hopefully we have that now. We'll go back to my radio and log in. So by clicking log in here and then transceiver. Yes, there is a yearly subscription for Hamsphere. And to fire up your transceiver, you click this. It comes up with this message, click OK. There's our transceiver. Next thing is to learn how to activate our new waterfall. So we'll go back to my transceiver page here. Instead of clicking transceiver, we'll go to editor, but we are logged in. It says default transceiver, we click OK. In this window, we can edit what we, you know, the add-ons and plugins that we'd like to see. So this is our transceiver. We can see the way we can actually move things around. The whole system is modular, very clever. So then we look on the left here at things we're allowed to have and they're all noughts but next to waterfall it looks like we've got gone for the widescreen waterfall so there may have been there may be two types you do have this sort of spectrum type so just for now we're just going to put that there we can buy more plugins but we're just showing how to purchase something so there we are and then we just go you can either go get more plugins here start buying more goodies the waterfall that i actually was looking at if i put in waterfall again in a search wasn't that one it was like a smaller square one not sure what that meant but they actually have a used shop you go second hand shop here i'm guessing that people that have decided they don't want to use there see these different antennas and items anymore decide okay well I'll, I, and you can actually sell it and there's some buttons here look i do not use one pound fifty power okay there one pound fifty and these ones here code selector band scope that looks like it could be the band scope for what they call the blue c which is all mobile phone I'm trying to see if there's anything there that interests me Oh, there's a next page here as well. Lots of goodies for sale. It's interesting that they do have a used section. 
microphone recorder, P nice big PTT, two euros. Now it does look quite smart if you buy it just for fun. Virtual, let's see how it, uh, let's just do it and see what happens. So we'll just go add to cart. And then we'll check it out. Oh, it looks like, remember, we've got to get our credits first before we check out. So I'm not gonna do that now. Let's go back to our our editing thing. And so we're gonna go save and exit. We've already purchased our waterfall. Now, if you can see, there's no activity. And this is all part of the learning, but I'm just gonna do this in tiny little steps. So save and exit, click yes. And then when we open our transceiver, just go by quite, this window appears, just click transceiver. Click OK, and then it'll load up the transceiver we've now got. But this time, as you can see, we've got the waterfall. And there is activity here, can we click it? We can. Oh, it's just brief. And while we're on this page, there's a PTT here. I'm going to buy that little red one, put it underneath. That would be nice. Vox, power it off. You've got contests, main, cluster, event, calendar, shop info, DX. So they have live contests. They even have two meter repeaters. And it's in the instruction manual, you can actually see the, the you know, what frequency you put in for your repeaters on two meters and 70 SEMs. So look, there's something come up there. Let's just click one. Not hearing anything, but it's there. As I learn, we will hear. Just showing that carrier. M0FXB calling for an audio check. Any, anyone receive me? Mike Zero Fox X Ray Bravo? You never know. I'm not seeing a squelch. There's a little, there's something there popping up that could have been a repeater so the, the whole point is that the whole thing feels like you know you you are using real you know a real transceiver and, and the, the software has been developed in that way what else can we look at let's go to 40 we'll go to and and, and even though the conditions are virtual they are linked to real life condi conditions they're not just random you can select different antennas here by the looks of it i've just left it default because i'm learning bandwidth let's click the contest just see what it brings up there you are and i and again learning events that's your main cluster log and these are real people that are talking. Propagation. You can play chess, which I'm not going to do now. And there's help there as well, look. Basically, a nice quick link to the instruction manual, which I am going to need. So, okay, there's a little taster. We've got our waterfall. Let's click here. Oh, I can hear Morse. I don't know if you heard that. Someone's doing Morse. Go back to main. We can just click the waterfall. I need to work out the step, how the step is done. Let me just click it here. There will be a, they see the bandwidth. We still haven't learned that one yet. And it's stopping at, is it stopping at 7100? So that's fine for now. Someone let me know. Uh, I'll, I've got lots to read, lots to learn, but I'm enjoying it. And uh, thanks for watching my channel. Bye for now. 7-3. There's your different modes there, look.